Welcome to Zeki's Planet! Oops. Hello everyone! Today we're gonna make this raw egg into a bouncy egg. Follow me in my science experiment with Joe's to find out how it works. For this experiment, our materials will be an egg, a glass, and white vinegar. First step is to put the egg in the glass. So, step two, I'm gonna put this white vinegar in the glass until the egg is submerged. Okay, I hope. I don't still if I spill, then I'm gonna buy an egg dog. I don't know what to do. No. He's alive! Oh, no. When I just put the vinegar in the glass where the egg is staying, it just started bubbling like this. The third step is that we're going to wait for two days until the egg will turn into a bouncy egg and we'll be checking on it every day. I hope you'll be a good one and As the egg based on the vinegar, the shell slowly dissolves. The bubbles clinging to the egg will cause the egg to float, flip and turn. After two days, you will need to drain the vinegar and replace it with fresh vinegar to continue the process of dissolving the egg shell. Let the egg sit with the vinegar for another day. We will come to know the egg is ready when it becomes slightly transparent. After that, the shell will be fully dissolved. Gently remove the egg from the glass and run it under tap water. Carefully remove any excess shell that may be on the egg. The shell of an egg is made of calcium carbonate. When the egg is placed into the vinegar, you see bubbles, which is the chemical reaction of the acid within the vinegar reacting to the calcium carbonate of the eggshell to produce carbon dioxide. You'll also be able to observe the egg getting larger as it sits in the vinegar because some of the vinegar is getting observed in the egg through its semi permeable membrane. After three days, our egg has finally changed into a bouncy egg. See the differences. First, it was small like this, but now it's big. And the color is translucent. See? Oh no, I'm so scared. Come guys, if it's truly bouncy, I will show you. I'll show you right now. Please.